The hospital can't run without blood, platelets, and plasma. Every two seconds, someone in this hospital needs a blood transfusion. The U.S. normally has a blood supply that lasts three to four days. So if, if all collections stopped, we would run out of blood in that time period. But today, the blood supply is less than one day. It's, um, it's a scary position to be in. If you're hesitant to donate and just come down to see the process, from the second you walk in the door until the moment you leave, you're being taken care of from beginning to end. I mean, what excuse do you have? It's safe, it's easy, it's convenient, and you feel good afterwards. I mean, there's really no reason not to do it. I've had hundreds and hundreds of blood transfusions in my life, so that's countless individuals. You think about all of those people. That's hundreds of different people who've touched my life in a very, very powerful way. I think it's important for people to know that blood donor centers are making it as safe and convenient as possible to donate blood because people like myself who are transfusion dependent can't wait. During the past two years, there have been a decreasing number of blood donors, but an increasing demand for blood products in our patients. If you consider that each donation can help up to three people, and you as an individual can donate five to six times a year. In just a small amount of time, your donations could help 15 to 18 patients per year. I donate blood because an hour of my time could save someone else's life. Blood donors are truly heroes. Um, they take time out of their busy schedules to go out and donate blood for strangers. And for that, I'm forever thankful. Please be a lifesaver, come down and donate. I am a lifesaver. Will you come and be one too? Donating blood is heroic. Be a hero with me today.